Majesty Ogiame Atuase III, the Olu of Wari, visited His Excellency, former President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, Chief Olusegun Obasanjo in Ota, Ogun State. The visit, their second meeting since His Majesty's accession to the throne, was an opportunity for His Majesty to extend this formula thanks to the former President for the fatherly role he played during the coronation. Accompanied by prominent palace chiefs of the Wari Kingdom, Your Majesty spoke glowing of Chief Obasanjo's virtues and value not just to the people of Ogun State but to the Nigerian nation as a whole. During the visit, Chief Olusegun Obasanjo, who turned 85 earlier in the month, made it known that he was receiving His Majesty in multiple capacities, first as an elder statesman, former president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, and second as a respected traditional ruler of Ogun State. Former president in his usual flamboyant style confirmed that he was now indeed the highest rank chief in Ogun State and to that end was sufficiently resourced to host his majesty. The visiting party subsequently represented an appreciation gift of a replica of his majesty's official royal red kenu, the symbol of his majesty's authority on the waters. Later, his majesty went on to visit the Alake and Para Mount ruler of Egbaland, HRH, Adidotun, Aremu, Badibo, with whom a formal visit had earlier been scheduled. At the Alake's palace, His Majesty was recovered by the Alake and the retinue of his palace chiefs, after which they held discussions that centered on the close bounds, shared heritage, and direct relationship between the Isekiri Kingdom and the people of Ogun State and the potential of strengthening those ties. They subsequently went on together to the government house in Abe Okuta, pay a courtesy call on the governor, His Excellency Prince Dakbo Abiodun, MFR.